Hey guys, it's Crystal, the founder of Bold Culture Beauty, a two-time award-winning blog and your first stop when you're looking to simplify your natural hair routine. Today, we're taking a closer look at consistency. So what does it mean to be consistent on your natural hair journey? Now, I've said before that consistency is key to achieving our natural hair goals, and it is. But what does it look like to be consistent? Now, on the most basic level, consistency is when we act or do something the same way over time to achieve accuracy. So in essence, anything we do consistently is where our strengths will lie. Now take a moment to consider what you've done consistently on your natural hair journey. Now evaluate where you are and where you want to be. For some of us, we still have a ways to go. If you're struggling to be consistent or you're curious about what it looks like to be consistent on your natural journey, well, you're in luck. Today, we're taking a closer look at what it looks like to be consistent on your natural hair journey. So grab a friend and grab a pen and let's take a closer look. Now let's be clear, consistently doing the wrong things can put us on the wrong side of our hair goals. When we consistently do the things that matter, it draws us closer to our goals and promotes the health of our hair. So what matters? Well, I've spoken at length about healthy hair practices and they will always be on my list of things that we should do consistently. To consider other areas where we should be consistent on our natural hair journey, check out this list. Number one, commit to properly caring for your hair. Two, ignore misconceptions. Cleanse, condition, and detangle your hair regularly. Maintain the health of your hair. And pretty important on my list, love, nurture, and embrace your hair. Okay, so now you're probably thinking, well, you've given me these areas where I need to be more consistent, but how do I go about actually becoming consistent? Well, are you ready for this? Get your pen and paper so you can take notes. Step one, identify a goal. And with my help, you've already been able to do that. Step two, establish a routine. And don't worry, I'm going to give you some tools to help you do that as well. And step three, hold yourself accountable. And I know you're probably thinking, Crystal, it cannot be that easy. But the reality is, it is. We probably can say and have planned several times to be consistent on our natural journeys. In fact, you're probably consistently doing something that doesn't serve you right now. When we commit to doing the right work on our natural journeys, it helps to have systems in place to hold us accountable and keep us consistent. Now this could be as simple as selecting a specific day for wash day or saying that you're only going to wait X amount of days between wash days. Tackle one thing at a time and once you've identified what you want to do, be consistent and hold yourself accountable. Once you've mastered that one thing, then move on to something else. Before you know it, consistently doing the right work will be second nature. A great way to become consistent on your natural hair journey is my Curl Friends Guide to Keeping It Simple. It's an easy tool that helps you create a consistent routine and assess your progress. And the best part, it's free. So I will drop a link in the show notes and you can grab your copy today and begin your journey to healthy hair success. Well guys, that is all I have for you today. Thank you so much for tuning into my channel and don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. And for more great tips on ways to simplify your natural hair routine and be consistent on your natural hair journey, make sure you head over to boldculture.com. And until next week, go boldly.